Once upon a time, I thought I was so smart, but now my life is falling apart. There's nothing I can do, a total eclipse of my hair part. Oh yeah. A total eclipse of my hair part. It's bad. Oh yeah. Yeah, right? What's going on, all you beautiful people? How you doing out there? How you feeling? You having a good day? Everything going all right? You, you, you feeling all right today? Everything good? All right, good. Let's get into this. Listen to this. First of all, let me say this. Hello, Gaffney. Second of all, let me say this. Hello, my son. By the way, a lot of good guesses. You guys threw out Michael Caine? Please, the GOAT. You know what? In all reality, yeah, it, you know, he might have said that at one point in time. I could totally see him saying that. And then somebody else said uh, Sean Connery and uh, another another GOAT. I mean, but uh, I don't know if he would have said something like that. You know what I mean? I just can't imagine him, you know, saying it and in that Sean Connery voice. I don't know. It's, I don't, I don't know. I think that's more of a, I think it's more of a English term, if you know what I'm talking about. Not a Scottish, like the old uh, Sean Connery. I believe he's Scottish, right? Right? Am I right? I think so. I'm pretty sure. Scotland. Anyways, let's get into this. So, um, it turns out... Oh, and by the way, uh, thank you for all the comments, all the... Oh, but don't forget, comment, like, subscribe, do all that good stuff. Your guys' comments are the best. This group is the best. You guys are the best. And here's one more thing I want to say this, too, okay? I've seen a lot of people write a lot of really great comments lately about, you know, just the nicest things in the world, okay? Put it that way. And let me just tell you this. Like, it, it, it's all of us together. Do you know what I mean? Like, you guys leave comments. I read them. You guys give me tips. And I'm always like, well, you know, I read in the comments this, that, and the third... So, and by the way, if I, if I don't get to all your comments, just trust me, there's, it would take like all day long to like heart everybody's comments and all that other stuff, but I am reading as many as I can. And, you know, once I drop a video, I always try to get to, you know, as, as many as I can right off the bat. But don't forget, you know, I got a full-time gig. I got, you know, blah, I got, you know, plus life's all nonsense. You know, you know what I'm saying? So, please, don't don't think that I don't love you. I love you, all right? I mean, most of you, like 99.9%. .9%. There's 1% of you that are, like, you know, out to left field. But, you know, what are you going to do? That's with anything. Now, let's get into this. All right, here we go. So, the Scheissmeist, <laughs> I mean... We know that she was slaying it in the uh, Nigerian fashion department. I mean, you want to talk about, like, what a chameleon, right? I mean, she blended right into the whole environment. Well, anyways, turns out the first lady of Nigeria doesn't really appreciate the princess, of, the new princess of Nigeria here. I don't think the first lady of Nigeria knows that there's a new princess in town. And uh, I don't think she's real happy about the whole situation, the whole situation. If you know what I'm talking about, let's watch this video here. Right, ready? She's gonna, she's gonna, uh, she's gonna go in on the Markle, the Sharkley, the Markley here. I don't think she was prepared for what Sharkley, the Markley had to bring to the table. The message here is we have to salvage our children. You know, we keep them away from the shist, the meist, and that dumb, that dumb, whatever, that bird brain that she uh, that dotes around on her all the time. I forgot who that guy is, but you know who that guy is. The, the, the Friar Tuck dude. You see the way they dress, they keep forgetting that Nigeria, we are beautiful. The moment you can see what they showcase on the stage, I said we are fashionable, we see what is going on. You know, we are not having a Met Gala. Yeah, thank, thankfully, thankfully. And by the way, I, 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 can we stop that Met Gala thing? I, I, honestly. Please, the ridiculousness that comes out of that bullshit is unbelievable. Don't even get me going on. Oh my god! I'm, what did you? What was with? The, what was going on with that lady? Oh my god! I want to have like a. I want to have like a one inch waist. I still can't get rid of my big fat ass, but I still want to have a one inch waist. Uh, uh, uh. Looks like something out of a a, 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 a horror movie. What's with that lady? Please stop it! I couldn't breathe. I farted and it and it blew up in my stomach and came out of my came out of my ears. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> you know what I mean? Like really, lady? She's like, I had to walk on my tippy toes. She didn't even have heels. She had to walk on her like. Who in the hell? Like, and not only that, she looked like shit. And then on on top of that, I'm oh, sorry. Segway. On top of that, she's holding the sweater. Oh, on her. Okay, so 
she's got the whole thing that cinched her down to like a one inch waist, right? She's still got this overblown, you know, uh, fuck badonka donk back there. Meanwhile, she, on top of that, she's got a balance on her tiptoes. Like, why weren't you, like, uh, uh, balancing this, uh, uh, like, a, like, a, like, a, like, a, like a, I don't know, like a soccer ball on your nose, too. Like, uh, unbelievable. Like, what are you doing, lady? Isn't she a billionaire? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I got $300 in the bank. I wouldn't, I, you, you please, I wouldn't dare. You know what I'm talking about? I walk around like I'm the cat's pajamas. Please. Think I'm going to go through all that bullshit? I got a billion dollars? I mean, kiss my ass. You're lucky if I even show up. Please. I'll wear my pajamas. And, and some fuzzy bunny slippers. At best. At best. What a dipshit. That lady's a dipshit. Anybody that follows that lady's a dipshit. And on top of that, I know I'm on this whole Kim Kardashian set. <laughs> Kim Kardashian. <laughs> On top of that, she gets the shit. It was the Tom Brady roast. You would have thought it was the Kim Kardashian roast. Kim Kardashian. You would have thought it was the Kim Kardashian roast. Oh, my. Holy sh crocodile. I should do a whole video on that. Oh, my God. Okay, back to this. And everyone, their nakedness is just everywhere. And the men are well clothed. So we have to do something. Tell them the way it is. We don't accept nakedness in our culture. They uh, Shasty, are you are you getting any of this? Did you you know you would have thought that Shasty having her genealogy, ge 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 what is it? I don't even know what it's called anymore. Ge genealogy. Why can't I say the word genealogist? She had a genealogy. <laughs> genealogy jeez louise you would have think having her genealogy done you would have thought she might have researched going to the motherland i don't know one google search could have helped you oh they don't walk around in these horrible outfits that i'm about to pack ah uh, let me change my uh my, my attire here do you uh, uh, do you think it was odd that they kept giving her more and more clothes like, like hey please 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 put something on not only are you you know, I'm sorry, kind of repugnant to look at. I mean, let's be honest. But please, 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 you're attracting flies. Like, please, stop it. That, that is not beautiful. It's not beautiful at all. And they're all beautiful girls. But they should be confident to know they are. Well, uh, sorry. You, 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 yeah. You, sh this is going way over Shiesty's head, okay? Think about this. Multi-millionaire, uh, world famous, uh, royal, title, money, everything, blah, blah. The woman is, is insecure and has to even wear, uh, she has to let you know that she has gold. You know what I mean? Like she's a uh, frumple still skin here. They don't want to be like, even they are mimicking and trying to uh, emulate film stars from America. They don't. They're like, uh, the 90210. The, the, the 90210. That girl. That girl. I don't know where they come from. Why did uh, Megan come here looking for Africa? That is something we have to take home with. We know who we are and don't lose who you are. Shiesty. I'm, t I'm saying, Shiest. I know you just became the princess of Nigeria, all right? But you're going to have to come to terms with the reality, okay? The Tijuana donkey. You, you can't do it. This lady's like, the one day, she, she's got man's shoulders. She's got man's shoulders, man hands, and the hugest pontoons we've ever seen. On top of which, she wore a Tijuana donkey outfit, and it, 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 she, it was repugnant. She was a, a, a atrocity to look at. And then she wore a red slip. What was going on? What was going on? <laughs> what was going on? What was what was all that shenaniganry in her red dress? That's what don't emulate her. She is a bird brain. Thank you. Thank you. All right, you guys let me know your thoughts. Hope you guys are all having a great day. You guys all be good. Who loves you, baby? You're beautiful.